It's Jackie from Happy Hooligans, and today we are making prints. And we're using just a styrofoam produce tray and a paint roller. So at Christmas time, we made some really lovely prints and um, used them as Christmas cards. And today we are going to make some Valentine's cards, and I thought I would shoot a little video just to show you step by step how it's done. It's really easy and you just need a few basic supplies and you can make some pretty impressive prints just using some things that you have around the house. So I'll show you what you need to get started. To make your prints you will need a styrofoam produce tray. Just make sure this is good and clean. We always run ours through the dishwasher to sterilize them before we craft with them because quite often they've had meat um, packaged on them. You'll also need some craft paint. We like acrylic craft paint, but you can use some, um, I'm sure tempera paints would work very well for this as well. You'll need a pair of scissors and a pencil. You will need a small paint roller, a high density foam roller. And you will also need a paper plate to um, pour and roll your paint in. So to get started, what you are going to want to do is you're going to want to cut out the middle section, the flat section of your styrofoam produce tray. So you can do that with a nice sharp pair of scissors and you will end up with a couple of pieces of styrofoam that you will make your prints on. Now a good idea if you are going to be using your prints to make a card is to size the styrofoam to the front of your card and then you're going to take a sharp pencil and you're going to draw your your image that you want to print um, you're going to engrave it into this piece of styrofoam. Now one thing to keep in mind is when you make your print, and I'll show you here with this piece, it will be, the print will be the reverse of your drawing because, you know, when you lift it off, obviously it's reversed on the card or on the piece of paper. So that's important to remember if you are going to include any words uh, in your print, you are going to have to make your letters and your words backwards. So to avoid that complication, we're not going to use words today. We're just going to draw something for our Valentine's card. So I'll get started doing that and uh, I'll come back in a moment and tell you how to make the actual print. You wanna go make a nice deep groove in your styrofoam. Okay, and we're ready to make our print. I'm actually going to use um, some pink on top of, right on top of the red paint, uh, paper plate and roller. So you want to load your paintbrush up with, or your roller up with quite a lot of paint. That's one of the key things to getting a good print. Now we might get the red and the pink kind of mixing together here a little bit and that's fine. That seems to be pretty good. So now we are going to roll the brush firmly on top of our styrofoam. You want to cover the entire piece of styrofoam. You don't want to press so hard that the paint goes all into your grooves because then, you know, you want a nice clean print. Once you have your styrofoam covered, it's time to print on your card or your paper. So you're just going to flip it over, line it up with your paper, and press firmly. And 
And now we'll lift up the styrofoam and see what our print looks like. Ta-da! How cool is that? What you can also do is let your styrofoam dry a little bit and you can switch to a new color. And you can make multiple, this is the great thing about printmaking, is once you make your styrofoam template, you can use that over and over again with any color that you want. And there we go. Now you can see some of the red has come through, and that's okay. Actually, that's kind of interesting. You can mix some colors. That would make um, a really pretty effect as well. But there you go. That's all there is to printmaking with a styrofoam produce tray and a high density foam roller. It's a great activity for kids of any age. And I hope you have as much fun with yours as we have had with our printmaking. For more fun and easy kids crafts and activities, join us at happyhooligans.ca. Mm -hmm.